after leaving a relationship, it is never easy to completely forget that person you were once close, someone you shared good and bad times with, and someone who you gave all. Because of all the time you spend, you have become so attached that it has blinded your eyes from seeing all the pain you went through while you were in the relationship. Number 1. It stops you from moving on and becoming the better version of yourself. I know this is not the first time you are hearing this and probably your friends and family have already told you to leave that ex. But because you are still blinded by the good memories, you find it so hard to move on. My dear, the moment you decide to move on, trust me, you will feel a new breath of fresh air. There are so many things you could be doing with yourself right now instead of holding on to your ex. There are many opportunities out there that you can explore. There is a saying that the sweetest revenge that you could ever give to your ex is your success and them seeing you being the better part of yourself. That version that you were never going to reach when they were in your life. If you stay put and still clinging on to your ex, they begin to feel that you cannot do without them. They begin to think that without them in your life, you cannot amount to anything. My dear, there is so much that you can be without your ex in your life. Instead of spending time stalking them on social media, why not improve your life? And by the time you finally get to the point that you have become more than what they knew you to be, they would become jealous and trust me, they would regret ever hurting or leaving you. And by that time, they realize that you would have been 10 steps higher than them and even you would have realized that you are no longer on the same level with them. And eventually, better people who are on your new level would come your way. If you don't leave your ex right now and move on, they would never see your importance and value. There is so much you can do. It is time to leave that ex now. Number 2. You would never find the right person if you keep being with your ex. Beloved, when you keep holding on to the past which is your exit stops you from finding the right person that God has in stock for you, it is most common with the female gender and it can still be found that a few may think like this that after a breakup and the guy maybe still shows them a little attention and care they begin to feel that he is the right one. The truth is what they are doing is that a few of them still keep in touch with you so as just to reduce the guilt that they are feeling for hurting you and you are not in any way responsible to make them feel better about what they did. When you are still being with your ex, it stops you from appreciating and seeing the good in other people that God would bring before you. All you think is of your ex, the time that you are supposed to be spent trying to discover other people to know if they are the right ones for you is the same time that you are spending being with someone who is not meant for you. The truth is, if they were the right ones, they would not have broken up with you. So stop deceiving yourself and leave that ex now. If you keep holding on to your ex which is not the right person for you, you block the door and prevent the right person from coming in. Don't hold on to that ex for so long before you miss the right person. Some people have missed the right person because they were blinded by the ex that they were still holding on to and by the time they realize the ex is already married to someone else and the person that was also begging for the attention too has moved on. My prayer for you is that though it's not easy to completely forget a person, you still can with the help of God. You can make that decision today to leave that ex now so that you don't miss it and end up settling for less. Settling for someone who is not your type or someone you would not wish to spend the rest of your life with. But you had to settle for it because age and time were not on your side. I pray that it would not be your portion because forever is a long time to be unhappy. Number 3. They are only using you. This is the bitter truth that we don't like hearing. But deep down, I know you can feel it and know that I'm saying the truth. It is possible that you still love them from the depth of your heart and you still holding on to it because you are still hoping that with time you both would feel the love back and go back to the way things were. But my dear, I'm not trying to be a pessimist, but you need to wake up from that dream and stop deceiving yourself. 
The human mind has become so selfish that people these days only think about themselves and what they stand to gain without considering how the other person is feeling or would feel after they are gone. So right now, you have only you to think for yourself and watch out for yourself. If you have engaged in sex before, and probably you are good at it, most ex would keep coming back into your life to just keep getting more of you and before you would realize that, they would have already had you to their satisfaction and nothing hurts more than you realizing that you were just used. So before they make the decision and finally leave you, which would be more painful, why not make the decision today yourself and leave that ex now? Apart from sex, there are other things that all these exes can still be keeping you in their life so that they enjoy from you. Yours could be money, connections, or maybe you are just easy to talk to and they love that part about you. Whatever the reason may be, the moment you have sensed it in your spirit that you are being used, you better be the one to cut it now and leave that ex. You wouldn't want to wait for them to do it themselves because it is going to be more painful. Number 4. It would keep affecting your present relationship. Nobody wants another person's baggage to be dropped on them. Your present partner can only be so patient before he or she reaches their limit. Everyone has their limit to what they can take and what they cannot take and you don't want to know what they would eventually do when they get to that limit. You are already blessed by God for him bringing someone else in your life but you want to still be the same person that destroys this relationship because you can't leave your ex. When you are still keeping that ex in your life, you would find it hard to completely appreciate this person that is right before you. That's because you will keep comparing he or she to that your ex and nobody likes to be compared. We are all wired differently by God so the more you keep comparing your present partner to your ex, they eventually get fed up because you have made them feel that they are not good enough. So instead of being with you who do not see their relevance, they prefer to walk away and you would not want that. Also, it's affecting your present relationship because you would keep bringing them up in almost all the discussions you would be having and nobody wants to keep listening to the stories of what you did with your ex. It can really become annoying and eventually they walk away. Beloved, before you get to the stage where you lose your partner again, why not leave that ex now? If they were that good enough for you, they would have still been in your life. Number 5. You can never go back to the way you were. One of the reasons why most people go back to their ex is because they are hoping that they would go back to the way things were again. But the bitter truth is, it can never be the same. You are already hurt and whether you like it or not, unconsciously, you would keep remembering what your partner did and it takes only the grace of God for you to completely forget. If your relationship with your ex is not acceptable by God, you would see that you are struggling to move on. And when you realize this, my dear, no matter how painful it is, I think you need to leave your ex now. Allow the things of the past to remain in the past and make that decision to move on. Things are going to be better than what you experienced with your ex when you meet the one for you. Stay blessed.